I mean, how does it feel joining Oxford United? Yeah, I'm over the moon, over the moon to get it done. I'm really excited to be here. Um, obviously, the, uh, the ambition of the club is, is something that I can, I'm really on board with and now I'm really looking forward to get going. Yeah, you watched us against Portsmouth on Tuesday night. We're a pretty good side. Yeah, no, I really, really enjoyed the game. I thought the boys were brilliant. Um, and I thought the style of play was, was something that's right up my street and I'm, I'm really looking forward to getting involved with the team and, and, ha- and trying to help them as much as I can. But yeah, I thought, to be fair, I thought they deserved to win the game. But uh, they were lucky with a couple of goals, but no, I think overall it was a really good performance. And uh, there's an to obvious it. question I have to ask you. Uh, you're joining a club chasing promotion from League One, from a club chasing promotion from League One. Why the change? Um, I think just this club suits suits better at this moment in time. And to be fair, I really want to. I really wanted to get here. I think the ambition of the club, and I also believe this this team is has more than enough to go up. And then with the ambition again, as I said, as the club, it's got enough to stay up as well. And um, yeah, no, I really like the direction in which the club is going and I'm really excited to get here and join the project. Uh, I'm confused. You are, in my eyes, a winger. When I looked on Wikipedia, just to check everything, it said wing back. Which are you? Definitely a winger. I think that's another reason for the, for like the change, like you said, you know, the, um, when I spoke to the club and what they want from me, it, it's, it's what I want to, to do in a, in a team and how I want to play. So yeah, it's a perfect fit. When you met the manager, he has a presence about him and he also has a clear way of how he wants to play, how he wants his sides to be. He's an impressive bloke to meet, isn't he? Yeah, you know, I had a short conversation with him. But like I said, yeah, no, it was, uh, it was a good conversation. And like you said, he has a presence and it's the way the team plays, it's definitely something I want to, a way I want to play. And no, it's good to speak to him and hopefully we can have another chat uh, in the week and crack on from there. Do you know any of the players in the squad already? Uh, obviously, I know, I know Judd Funley from... Um, Obviously, he's from Ramai, but also played with him at Blackpool. But other than that, I don't, I don't know him, any of them personally. But obviously, I've played against quite a few of them a lot. So, and I know, I know how high quality they are. So, yeah, it'd be good to get in the next one. Jordan's got the driest sense of humour of anybody I've ever met. <laughs> yeah, I think that's just <laughs> like from where we're from. Um, <laughs> yeah, but no, he's, 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 a, he's, a, he's a character. He's a good lad. Yeah, definitely is. Um, you join us ahead of a game against Reading on Saturday. Are you aware it's a big local derby? I've been, I've been, I've been made aware. Yeah, but they're the sort of games you want to be involved in. They're the sort of games you want. You know, the big atmospheres and no, it'd be, it'd be exciting. And hopefully, I can, I can be involved and, and help the team. And the one after that's Blackpool away, isn't it? Yeah, that'll be a, an exciting game as well. Um, no, I'm looking forward to, to. I think we've got a really exciting back end of the season here, and I know there's a lot of boys coming back as well. So I think we'll finish strong and. I think we'll be right in, right in the mix and right up there.